Gentlemen, welcome back to the mess, which is my desk, and I've lost my opening weapon. It was here a second ago, so we're going to have to do this bareback. Right, uh, give you a heads up, I've had quite a bit of mail over the last couple of days, and I've already been in there and opened some of it up. So let's start with the one which I've already opened. Uh, I ordered this a while back, and it's the I am away, however they pronounce it, directional antenna. Oh, thank you for the weapon, Poppet. So I've got a weapon now. And I used this on Sunday. Works amazingly well. Super impressed with that. So it came with a lovely little box and uh, happy days. I put that on the uh, diversity receiver, which actually works. And while I'm here, I'm gonna pop it back in the box with the diversity receiver. Yeah, super impressed with that. I think it was about tenner, something like that. What else have we got on this one? Oh, we've got another one of those uh, cheaper receivers for uh, FR Sky. In the, like I said in a previous video, that the protocol uh, FR Sky protocol was reverse engineered and then published on GitHub. So literally over the next good couple of months, we will start to see some cheaper uh, receivers being delivered. Now, this one, unlike the smaller one which I had the other day, which had SBUS, this one has got PPM out, which is really, really curious. And I think we jump uh, channels one and three, as indicated on there. Uh, and we can also use that as a bind tool as well to bind this up. Now, I don't know on the range, I think this one was about 12 quid. Uh, and if you didn't want to use it for PPM, uh, then you could just use it for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven channels. Happy days. So yeah, nice little receiver. That needs to go in the receiver box in a minute. And I'm just gonna check the bag to make sure. Ah, oh, no, there's only a sticker. Sorry, only a sticker left in that one. So we'll put that to one side. What else have we got here? Let's go and open this one up. Oh, talk about perfect timing. I've also ordered some of these feet as well. Now, they were 76 pence, so about a dollar. Uh, and I bought these to go on the bottom of the 250 quads. But because I've been and received, oh, that's not gonna work out, is it? They're just not thick enough to go on the bottom of the 180 quad. So yeah, the, the quad which really, really needs it, can't use it because we got this bottom plate on the bottom uh, where the power distribution board is on. So let me put that back to one side. It was really meant for the uh, 250 quad. And you can see I've been ragging that because there's a broken prop on that one at the moment. <laughs> so yeah, those are the little orange feet which stick up underneath, uh, which is going to be a bit of a challenge because you'll see that I've mounted up LEDs on my uh, feet on that one. So I'm not entirely sure how that's going to fit on there, but yeah, it's got to be better than the carbon fiber ones I've got. And I got black and orange for those. Happy days. We'll put those up out of the way and a sticker. Let's open up the next one. Yeah, you can tell this is from Banggood. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. I bought this. Any guesses what it is? It's not a bottle opener. It's a nut tightener. So if I grab the other quad, which I've been working on and put that on the desk, uh, is that it's a carbon fiber nut tightener so yeah it was only like a quid so i thought it was a bit of a bargain so yeah happy days that needs to go in the quad box or in fact in the toolbox so I, I can use it now this one again i've been in this one and i can't remember what else was in this package oh yeah that bit annoyed me this while a longer one was a quid mm, not the best bargain i've ever had off banggood to be honest and yeah, it is longer. It's longer by quite a fair distance as well. So the usable length uh, is 23 centimeters. So it is a longer one, but to be honest, it wasn't worth the extra money com considering that uh, for a one pound more uh, is that you could have five slightly shorter ones. So yeah, to be honest, that was a bit of a disappointment if I'm honest, especially on Banggood when they showed having uh, five of these in the picture. So I was a bit annoyed about that. Uh, oh, and by the way, links to all these items are in uh, the video description for you. And of course, if you've got any questions about these, please just ask, because remember, I've got them here in my hands. 
And the last package which we've got today contains, oh, not that exciting because you saw me open these up a couple of days back. They are some more drill bits. So these were about three pounds, something like that. So we got some really, really thin ones. That's about one millimeter. That's 1.5 mil, that's two. Uh, that looks like 2.5, although they've not marked on the uh, actual shaft of the drill bit, and those look like three millimeters. So yeah, happy days, some more drill bits. So yeah, quite a nice haul today. Uh, those foam bits are going to come in handy. I've already been in the in one of the packages because I kind of knew what was in it, which was that directional antenna, uh, and I needed to. Well, I wanted to test that out with the diversity re re uh, receiver, which I had a couple of days back. So there we go, there's today's mail haul. Uh, like I said, links to all these items are in the video description. If you've got any questions about them, please just ask, because like I said, I've got them here. Uh, they're either on my desk, in the mess somewhere, uh, or over in the box, or actually being used on a model. So with that said, before I go, what have you received in the post this week? Uh, you can let me know in the comments section underneath this video. So with that said, as always, for myself, Matt, thank you ever so much for taking the time to watch this episode and I shall see you soon. Cheerios!